Well, tonight is an honor for us to have Michael Gerson to speak with us and tomorrow to help us in the celebration of our groundbreaking for our new entrance and roadway up the campus. After being graduated from Wheaton College, Michael Gerson worked with Chuck Colson on research and writing projects. He served with Senator Dan Coates as a policy director and speech writer, including writing legislative proposals to promote the work of faith-based institutions. He left Capitol Hill to begin work for former Congressman Jack Kemp. He served as a speechwriter for Senator Bob Dole during his presidential campaign. And he continued his journalistic journey as a senior editor for U.S. News and World Report before being asked to serve on then-Governor George Bush's campaign staff. Until June of 2006, Mr. Gerson served as speechwriter and policy advisor for President Bush, defining and giving substance to the meaning of the phrase, compassionate conservatism. Today I enjoy reading Mr. Gerson's columns in the Washington Post. Would you give a warm Brian welcome to our speaker this evening, Michael Gerson. I truly believe in the cause of Christian education. I'm the product of it. Christian uh, education can provide not only an academic uh, basis for a career, but the strong foundation for life. And Christian education can also provide a mission, a calling from the king himself, not just to achieve, but to serve, not just to learn, but to love. There is something essentially countercultural about Christian faith that should make all believers restless in a political coalition. Christianity indicts oppressive government, but also the soul-destroying excesses that sometimes come in freedom. It teaches enduring moral rules and an emphasis on justice for the least and the lost. It is often hard where liberalism is soft, and soft where conservatism is hard. If Christianity were identical to any political movement, something would be badly wrong. It looks to a kingdom not of this world, a kingdom without borders, flags, or end. And by this standard, we will never in this life be fully at home. But by standing up for the values of this other kingdom, we make a large difference in the kingdoms of this world. It is the salt that preserves the whole, the light that reveals the entire landscape. This is the kind of vision that can change a country. It is the kind of vision that motivated Wilberforce and Shaftesbury and Garrison and Bryan. And it is the kind of vision this college is attempting to provide. Realizing this kind of calling is the work of a lifetime, but the journey must start somewhere. And for me, it started in a place very much like this one. Preparing young people for lives of meaning and service is a high calling. Every administrator and teacher deserves your thanks, and they deserve something more. They deserve your support. Thank you very much. Thank you.